good morning a couple of minutes in to this short session and I've got a roach on the bank although the days are quite nice at the moment if you wrap up warm they are dry that's an important thing for a lot of people nevertheless it's still quite chilly I still got all my winter fishing clothes on here and although I didn't leave the house till after half past nine I was scraping ice off the car windshield so we're not out of winter just yet are we although we're definitely as it seems on the on the right path that's always good nevertheless as an angler you still need to wrap up warm and look after yourself and that also means a nice cup of tea for me anyway at the water's edge this is a flask that my wife bought me for Christmas my old one was well past its sell-by date I think it's true to say that all my fishing tackle gets to that stage I don't change things for the sake of it when I replace something it's because it it has gone and I'll tell you what on that I'm gonna step back and I'm gonna show you what my suit looks like so you'll get the point that I'm making perfectly I think I need a new a new suit there don't I actually the the uh, jacket and the trousers aren't matching anyway so I'm not interested in things like that matching tackle and and all that it has to be functional as far as I'm concerned so the trousers with this jacket have already gone and now these are old ones that are about to join them it will be on my list for March's tackle order what I do I keep it on my phone actually and as I work through my sessions I think mm, need this particular size hooks need some shot maybe need a couple of floats I've got maybe a different type of fishing coming up need to get some different types of gear so I make a note on my phone and then on the first of the month I start to work through it and put my orders in or visit the local tackle shop if you can support them and combination of both for me order and in person and you stay ahead of things then so you're never on the bank and you think oh no I've run out of whatever it is and I'm here for the day and what do I do so it's good to plan ahead in advance isn't it in life in general and as far as your fishing tackle is concerned in particular the sun's coming up now you can probably see from the the hazy screen that's how it looks like to me anyway but still cold Frank commented on my guest book on the website about how good it is to have somewhere like this which is just three minutes away from home it is indeed Frank it really is and especially if you're like me you fish a lot I've been out every day so far this year you can't really well I certainly can't travel great distances a lot of my sessions have to be really short like for example today I'm going to a working game this afternoon in the Wrexham area so I'll be gone from about half past two and then back home in the early hours of tomorrow morning so I have to plan things out accordingly and local water perfect gear already made up including a float rod you can make that up as well everything ready to go you do save a lot of time that way because if you have the sort of fishing that you do whereby you need to take the kitchen sink as we call it and it takes forever to set up that's not really going to fit into my particular lifestyle so <clears throat> nice and simple down the water's edge fishing within a relatively short time short journey there as well and it means like today I can get about an hour and a half in which suits me that certainly ticks the box as far as I'm concerned because of perch I've been going straight through on a four pound Maxima chameleon to a size 14 with 
two maggots. However, it hasn't deterred the small roach at all. Still catching plenty of those. I'm getting ready to go now. Nothing big at all on this particular trip. Lots of small roach, no perch, just roach. It doesn't matter though, I've enjoyed it and as I say on many occasions, that's what really counts, isn't it? I'm watching my float for the final time when I've recorded this clip, I'll be packing away, get home, shower, change, and then I'll be on my way to the JD Cymru Premier as the New Saints take on Kevin Druids this evening.